Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody sent me this file, and it has, let me change my pick tool back to my normal pick tool. It has 430 objects right here. I group this one together, and it has 11. I'm going to move it out of the way. There's an easy way that you can do it in Corel, but it's going to be time-consuming with all this is use the Smart Fill tool and Smart Fill these sections and then take it and left click, no fill, right click, outline. Now there's only five objects. From 11 to five, it took away six objects that are in here. But there's a lot of items in here, but that can be done. Uh, my question is, why are you gonna are you gonna vector this whole thing with hairlines? Uh, if you engraved it, it wouldn't really matter how many items there were. You could let me put this one back. You could change it to something just above a hairline and raster that item and then the double lines won't matter. I think double lines are only gonna matter in um, cutting. But let's, uh, I have Monster Macro, uh, E-Cuts for Monster Macro, it's like 60 bucks, does a lot of stuff, and here's one of the things it can do. So if you look, we have 430 objects. I'm gonna go to Monster Macro, open up, find duplicates. My tolerance is 0 0.001. It found 256 duplicates. Delete them? Yes. Now let's take that same glove. And I'm going to use the freehand pick tool to freehand it. We got nine out of objects instead of 11, but there's no duplicates now. Let's just kind of look at it. Let's take and go to object, group, and ungroup. And get a regular pick tool back. Get the outline, which is one odd object. And then there are eight more because every one of these is an object. But it got rid of the duplicates. So if you don't want to take the time, and I mean, go, and, and I'm not trying to promote it. I, uh, I just got this years and years ago. I mean, it, and it does so much. Um, you can have so much fun with it. It's, it's worth every penny of $60. Um, but I am not promoting it. I'm just telling you what's out there. So you could smart fill it. And some of them are gonna be easier than others. Let's just do this recipe book. And really, you only have to do the outline of the book and the letters. And if you just keep your hand on the arrow keys, you know, you have to look away. And then go back to no fill and outline. And you have the same thing with just five objects. Let's see how many are in here than this one. Freehand pick tool. Freehand pick tool. Freehand pick tool is pretty cool for this. Just four objects. And I have five now. Ha! <laughs> um, what's the deal with that? Oh, yeah. It's because I've already taken all the objects away that in the original picture. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit, and thank you for watching.